quick little garage that I'm actually insulating at an R40. Little tip there for sure, uh, the more vents, you probably want to put them higher than uh, this homeowner did. Because this is very difficult to not cover. The only way to not cover them is to shoot directly at them, but at a close range like this, and it'll actually bounce off. You see it's all clear. So the R40 is a 14.6 inches for Owens Corning fiberglass. And uh, yeah, so this is, you gotta, you know, always look for these two by fours and insulate under them before you, uh, you move on. Very, very important. Like this, right, right around the attic hatch. So I'm gonna, I always, I'm always working towards the perimeter and after that, uh, getting to the end. So I'll give you the uh, final product of this. All right, so as you can see, I've pretty much finished off the perimeter. I'm just working away. This is always a tough part here. So you always angle your hose sideways like this to try and get around that last truss that uh, sort of makes that mark for the change in uh, the roof direction. At least the trusses. There you go. Still good? Still good, yep. Yeah? Yep. This is a 700 square foot garage, so it, uh, you know, estimated it takes about 14 bags of the Pro Pink insulation to get that R40. About two bags for 100 square feet. That's what I sort of estimate usually. It's a good estimation. Gotta get in close so that you don't get the blowing in the soffit. Just like that. And then, no blockage. So you got good airflow. Alright, so I stopped the machine there. It's as far as I can go. I'm gonna finish it off at the attic hatch. Taking out the extra hose. So this is where you do your cupping, typically. By that I mean you put your hand over it. That's just to cover right on the edge of the attic hatch like so. You still want to try to work your distance. So you're not crushing the, the material. It's getting a nice spread. So finishing touches there. Best way to see if it's all even is to look through your, your trusses and to see that it's all even, just like that. Okay. Now, I'm gonna test the depth. Oh, I trust it. There, so it's about 14, you know, if you're looking at it really. 13, 14, so I'm just going to add a bit, and then we're good. Your 40 all 
world and you can check out my other videos on attic insulation, how to install it, and some of my other tough jobs. You know, scroll through my channel, put a comment down below as to your installation questions and I'll be sure to get back to you as soon as I can. Give a nice thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and uh, we'll see you in the next video.